hi guys welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here my name is veronica welcome to the blessed family as you guys can already tell by today's video it is going to be a clean my kitchen with me so it's going to be a deep cleaning of my kitchen it's going to be a speed cleaning video i hope that you guys can get some extreme cleaning motivation from this video guys but before we begin i did want to mention that robo assist sent me one of the robo vacuum cleaners so i can test out and give you guys my honest opinion this is not whatsoever sponsored this is the cleaner that i received the robo vacuum cleaner it is amazing and i'm definitely going to share more with you guys as the video goes around so definitely go ahead and stay tuned for that but look at this humongous mess i have a huge mess going on over here in my kitchen so we're going to go ahead and clean that up before we get into the deep cleaning and let's go ahead and clean this mess. I can never keep up with them dishes like whatsoever it's just never never ending on the cleaning here in my house and that's why I could do so many cleaning videos because it's just always a hot mess in my house no matter how much I clean and try to keep up with the house I just can't the other day me and my husband went on a little hike and we saw these like big old huge mansions like big huge houses around the area we went on a little walk and hiking and I told my husband I was like you know what even if I could afford it I would not want to live there just because I would have to upkeep on a bigger house how much work would I have to do of course if I had the money I would probably hire a maid to do it but I'm just saying like it would just be too much for me to handle whatsoever like a bigger house than what i already have three bedrooms two bathrooms if i have anything bigger i just could not handle the mess who else feels the same way leave me a comment down below And literally, we moved the refrigerator to clean underneath the refrigerator because I had not moved it since we moved into this apartment. And I just told my husband if he can go ahead and move it, that way we can go ahead and clean down there because I knew I had a bunch of stuff that had fell over there. And I just never got around to do it. So I was like, you know what? This would be the perfect time to do it since I'm doing it deep cleaning in my kitchen. Look at how dirty the side of the refrigerator is. It's filthy. That is so disgusting. I just really had to zoom in for that and look at the back of it. It is so, so gross. I mean, like, 
who does that? Who has this huge mess on the back of the refrigerator? Well, I do. I am all that I need. No need to apologize. I got all that I need. No need to apologize. No, we won't waste any more time. husband was like ew is that mold back there and i was like no it's just dirt we need to clean it so i decided to just spray some uh, method cleaner and then some pine salt on the ground and then i i just took a towel and started um cleaning the bottom i didn't want to do it with my mop i was like you know what i'm just gonna do it with a towel and just go ahead and wipe everything down because it was just too dirty that i felt like the mop was not going to get everything i needed to really really scrub down there such a difference it looks way better than how it looked before um i still couldn't get all the black out of the walls but i figured I did as much as I could and I wiped it down as many times as I could but now I'm gonna go ahead and get to the refrigerator area right there because it was just getting horrific it was so so disgusting I really need to get to this <laughs> all right guys so for the month of december i really want to do a lot of deep cleaning organizing decluttering just a bunch of cleaning around my house for the whole month of december because i'm like so tired of having a mess and i really want to start off the new year fresh so that's probably what's going to end up happening who else is with me and wants to start off the new year fresh and decluttered and just clean beautiful house leave me a comment down below if you guys are down to do the same thing I honestly, truly, absolutely love the Robo Assist. It works amazing. I was so super happy when they sent it over, guys. It was definitely, it is worth the price, no joke. This little thing is amazing. It does the cleaning for me. I don't have to clean. I normally put it on when Emma is asleep because Emma likes to get to it and she literally wants to climb on it or grab it so i definitely have to do it during her nap time or when we leave the house it does come with with the control and you could also control it online as well in your phone so i usually let it um let it do its thing while nobody is home that way you can get to everything but right now since i was doing the cleaning and i wanted to show it to you guys i let it do its thing 
but um, it does come with a controller, comes with a charger, it comes also with Wi-Fi, you can go ahead and control it that way, like I said earlier, and they were nice enough to leave me a promo code for you guys, so you guys get 20% off, so I'm going to leave everything, the link down below in the description box for you guys, and also the promo code for you guys, just in case you guys want to purchase, and also they're not going to be using the promo code for Black Friday through Cyber Monday, so I'm going to remove that code for you guys um, during that time because it will not work during black friday or cyber monday after cyber monday i'll go ahead and put the code back in there so you guys can go ahead and purchase it and get 20 percent off either way they'll be having a good um discount during that time during black friday and cyber monday so definitely i'll leave the link for you guys down below that way you guys can take advantage of that discount as well but i highly highly definitely recommend this um product for you guys but anyways let's go ahead and keep cleaning and cleaning guys so i'm getting to the second load of dishes because i did have the dishwasher running and i still had dishes and i wanted to clean the stove drips um the little pan drips i wanted to clean those and i was like you know what i need to clean the dishes that are left over because i didn't want to get all the rust and mug and disgustingness from those um drip pans on my actual dishes so i was doing that before i cleaned the stove but Anyways, enough of the explanation. I'm sure you guys are going to see in just one second. I met him on a sunny day in late July And everything turned upside down I almost lost track of time as weeks went by I couldn't get him off my mind I told him I want that great love Like standing in the middle of a bonfire You don't know how you got there but you hold tight Knowing that you can't get burned all right guys so if you guys been watching me for a very long time you guys already know that my sink always looks dirty even when it's clean i scrub 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 but you know there's a lot of chips and this very very old apartment complex that i live so that's just how the sink looks i promise you it is definitely clean and i scrub it as much as i can and clean it every single time that i do the dishes that's just how my sink looks but Anyways, now that we're done with the sink, we're gonna go ahead and start cleaning the stove, but look at how disgusting these things look all the time. It's like no matter what, some of them are just, I cannot get the rust out of it. It's just very, very old. Like I said, my apartment complex is old, but most of it I can get out as much as I can. So you guys will definitely see me. Now I'll just go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and um, scrub the stove i did use a hox on it mix it with water and i'm just scrubbing the heck out of this baby Now I do add some Mahox to this as well and just scrub it out and leave it soaking while I finish cleaning the rest of the stove and then I come back to re-scrub this as well just because I like to scrub this like 
three to four times before all the guck and disgustiness comes out of it how often do you guys clean your stove and um also what type of stove do you guys have because i'm like living through you guys because again my apartment complex is very old so i have like very old stoves so definitely leave me a comment down below what kind of stove you guys have and how often you guys clean it guys so that is what i did for that day the next day i woke up and i started all over again with deep cleaning the kitchen i'm gonna make myself a nice little coffee basically the day before i went and after i was done with the stove cleaning i went and i got some hair dye to dye my hair darker for the fall and the winter so i actually ended up um, dyeing it a darker brown i don't know if you guys can tell i'm sure you guys will be able to tell for the rest of the video but um I decided to start where I left off and I'm just making a little bit of coffee and I was mixing in uh, my soap with water so I can go ahead and deep clean my tables. I'm sorry, not my tables, my chairs because they were so disgustingly dirty. I was like, girl, you need to clean those. How about if you have people over here? It's just really, really gross. So I decided to just go ahead and scrub that out. I literally scrubbed these things like three to four times before I got them clean. So that's what you'll see me doing right now.
wow look at how disgusting that water is it is so gross but at least they're clean now and i was just putting in my creamer that way i can go ahead and get some energy for the rest of the cleaning because i was going to be cleaning my dirty dirty baseboards and i needed as much energy as i could so i just took one of my sponges that i have to clean my baseboards and i did the cleaning of all the baseboards around that area of the kitchen area and i also cleaned the counters um sorry not the counters the drawers as well so that's what you'll see me doing right now how often do you guys clean your drawers and and um your baseboards in the kitchen please let me know leave me a comment down below because i think i wait i went way too long without cleaning those baseboards in my kitchen let me just tell you way too long they look so so gross started Christmas shopping and we are getting so close to like Black Friday and Cyber Monday and all these other deals and all that stuff do you guys wait until those deals come along to start shopping or do you guys start your shopping way before then let me know leave me a comment down below I'm gonna go ahead and start sweeping guys and I started um, my mop was actually run I ran out of the spray so I was just using pine salt to clean uh, the floors and that's why you saw me sprinkling on the floors
actually get a lot of comments on my trash can there's a lot of people that really love it and want to know where i got it i actually did not get the trash can my mother-in-law gave it to me for like a christmas i think it was last christmas or the christmas before no it was last christmas and she did buy it for me on amazon i should try to look for it and link it down below if i find it one of these days i'll go ahead and link it down below for you guys because i've been getting a lot of questions on that look at night and day look at how good my seats look i was getting a little claustrophobic with all the stuff that i had in my um my refrigerator and i decided to declutter it claustrophobic what am i talking about anyways it was just getting too much over there and i just decided to declutter it before i ended this video for you guys and leave me a comment down below what do you guys think about my hair does it look better darker or lighter and if you guys made it to the end thank you so much leave me a like a comment and subscribe have a blessed day